Hi, my name is Eric, and I'm one of the product managers here at Silence. In this session, I'm going to be talking about how do you use OpenSSL as a tool for validating your certificates. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to check to see if your private key is good. So here you can see the command I use. And the response I got was RSA key OK. If it doesn't say that, that means your key is bad and you'll have to get another one. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to check to make sure that my fully qualified domain name that I'll be using for my Silence Hybrid and Silence On-Prem matches the certificate. What you're going to be looking for specifically is that when you issue this command to, to look for your fully qualified domain name, you're going to make sure that the, under subject, your common name has the fully qualified domain name that you'll be using. And then one more place, you're going to make sure that the subject alternative name has the fully qualified domain name that you'll be using. And in this case, they both have the same, which is what I, I, I'm looking for. The next check that we can do is we want to make sure that our certificate and our private key matches. So the first one we're going to do is we're going to extract the modulus from the certificate. This is the hash value, the MD5 hash value of the modulus. Now we're going to do the same, but we're going to do it for the private key. As you can see, both MD5 hash values of the certificate and of the private key are exactly the same. This tells me that the private key and the certificate match. Now the last thing we're going to do is we're going to use OpenSSL and make a connection to our fully qualified domain name or our server. As you issue that, it'll give you information about your certificate, it'll give you any sort of certificate chain that you have, and some and other information that's useful. You can even issue HTTPS commands. I won't do that here today, but you can also do that using this command. Thank you for watching this session of the Product Spotlight series.